Good afternoon or good morning, Tigers, depending on when you are watching our award ceremony. I'm here to present today our ELA awards for sixth and seventh grade for trimester two and trimester three. When I was going through English class with Mr. J. Smith, we talk a lot about English class and what it means to us each trimester. And in this trimester, in the second and third, we were looking at students who, of course, tried very hard, who worked exceptionally and did a very good job with their writing. So I am very pleased to announce our sixth grade trimester two recipient as Maddie Bridges, our seventh grade trimester two recipient as Cynthia Oliver, our trimester three sixth grade recipient, Sam Hughes, and our seventh grade trimester three recipient, as Mackenzie Cameron. Congratulations to all of you and thank you so much for your great work in English class this year. Hey guys, I've got some math and science awards to give out. I'm um, gonna start with math. So our trimester two math award winner is Sissy Luttrell and trimester three is Addie Byrne. For science, uh, my trimester two award winner is uh, Sarah Wilkins and trimester three is D'Angelo McCulley. These students have all shown great effort in class, great participation, and I've seen huge growth in all of these four students. Good job, guys. Hello, Tigers and Tiger families. Welcome to the Excellence in Science Awards for Trimester 2 and Trimester 3. Uh, we'll start off with Trimester 2 for 7th grade. Uh, and the student that I'm going to talk about right now uh, probably will blush when I find out that I'm talking about her because that's just her, her nature. Uh, but this student asks great questions. Uh, always the hardest worker in the room, um, really works hard to make sure that she's doing the things the way that I'm asking the students to do them. Uh, and she's always one that I can call upon uh, when I need to uh, make sure that the instructions are clear for the class. Uh, the student is uh, a great student in science, and I'm happy that we're going to have her back next year as an eighth grader, and that's Ms. Tori Arden, seventh grade excellence in science for trimester two. For trimester two, eighth grade, uh, this student, probably one of the quietest students I have in the room, um, but definitely a hard worker, kind of under the radar, getting every answer correct on quizzes and tests. Um, blowing everyone else out of the water when we play trivia games for science uh, and just working hard without needing a bunch of recognition right up front. So it's time to recognize them. So your eighth grade trimester two science excellence award winner is Michael Johnson. And then finally, trimester three, end of the year. This is tough at the end of the year to stay focused. And this young lady for seventh grade did a great job of staying focused. Um, and making it look easy. Um, as a matter of fact, when I went to look at the grades, it's not that I didn't expect her to have a high grade. I just didn't know it was going to be as high as it was. Um, and this young lady just knocks it out of the park every time we do stuff with science. And I can't wait to have her back again next year as an eighth grader. And that is Miss Alina Williams, trimester three, seventh grade science excellent award winner. Tigers, Tigers families, um, have a great summer. I can't wait to see all of you that are returning next year and all of those eighth grade science award winners, past, present, and future. Well, not future, um, but past and present. I can't wait to hear the great things you're doing in high school. Have a great day. For the math award for trimester three in seventh grade, I would like to recognize a student who is great at working with others, likes to participate in those collaborative discussions in class. I can see this student really enjoys making sense of the problems that we have and figuring out, well, why can I get that answer? How does this work? And a student who's very self-driven, I can tell that this person wants to do a good job, works very hard, and I am super proud of Mr. Derek Camp. Congratulations, dude. Well done this year. Looking forward to eighth grade math with you. Hi, guys. I'd like to present our second trimester seventh grade math award to a student who is continuously asking and answering questions, someone who did a really good job of being active online while we were still distanced for part of that second trimester and still very active once we were back in class on campus.
This is a student who does a great job of supporting others and working together in class. And I love that this person is always looking for patterns. Congratulations to our math award winner for trimester two in seventh grade, Rain Jamelli. Congratulations, kid. Well done. Hey, happy year, Tigers. You made it through this crazy year. Um, I'm going to go ahead and announce the second and third trimester award winners for PE. These students all did an amazing job um, just showing up and being ready to rock. Um, so first, of, first up in the second trimester, the second trimester, these students did a great job, not only are in the, they showed up to every uh, meet when we were stu still doing virtual meets, and then they transitioned and, and did a great job in uh, taking care of business with in-person PE. So um, the following three people um, received the second trimester award, Naya, Jimenez from sixth grade. Congratulations, Naya. It's been great um, having you in my class this year. I look forward to next year. Um, Arshdeep Dot, also um, in seventh grade, is, is a second trimester award winner. Arshdeep also did a great job of, she showed up to every meet, and then also when we were having our environmental club meetings, uh, showed up to every one of those meetings as well. And then the third winner in eighth grade is Levon Givens. Levon uh, had a great attitude all year, had great energy, um, lo you know, was always asking if we do more when we were doing fitness workouts. So, yeah, I really appreciated that, Levon. And then in the third trimester, third trimester was all in person. So, um, we only, I only handed out um, seventh awards for sixth and seventh grade because like, we give a student of the year for eighth grade. So, um, in sixth grade, we have Amani Rafiq. Always showed up ready to compete, had a great attitude, just played hard, got teammates involved when we were playing um, competitive games, always shared the ball with all teammates, and um, just really brought brought that great energy and competitiveness in a, in a good-spirited way. And then uh, in seventh grade, Kara Jarvis. Kara, Kara did a great job, um, you know, always going going full, full throttle, diving for loose balls and uh, popping back up. So, yeah, really enjoyed enjoyed watching that. I uh, look forward to uh, having you all as 7th and 8th graders next year. All right. Have a good summer. Hello. I'm happy to present these Social Studies Awards to the following students. For the second trimester, the Social Studies Award goes to Brooke Kirstein, 6th grade. And for 7th grade, this, the second trimester Social Studies Award goes to Bryson Kennerson. Now for the third trimester. The sixth grade award winner for social studies is Ajay Deal. And the seventh grade social studies award winner goes to Arshdeep Dot. Hello, I am back with our pause award for sixth grade trimester two and three. Um, our pause award goes to a student who has shown themselves to be a great student, a great friend. Um, they follow directions. They follow rules. They help other people. Um, these are just, it just an overall good kid. Um, and we had a lot of good kids this year. This was a really tough decision for us, um, but we narrowed it down and we came up with our trimester two award winner is Natalie Haggard. And our trimester three pause award winner is Paige Wilson. Congratulations, girls.